Oh my gosh, son. I'm pretty excited about today. Who knows, me and you could walk out of here $250,000 richer. He he he. Not only that, there is a two-week-long vacation to Gatlinburg on the line during today's tournament. I will finally get a chance to visit that sweet Fanny Adams Theater, the Comedy Barn, the Ripley's Aquarium, and the Titanic Museum, all in one trip. Ha 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 ha. Of course, I have to win first. It's not easy, oh and a perfect 300 you know. But of course, you know your mom. All those attractions you want to see are all well and good, but if we win that quarter of a million dollars, your mommy's gonna... Shop 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 shop! Ha 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 ha! Story of my life. Spending three or four damn hours stuck in an outlet mall with mom. I would rather visit Bass Pro Shop or GameStop. Now, where is that silly Deke logo? He was supposed to come watch our tournament today. Deke. Here I am. Ha 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 ha. Oh goody. There you are, Deke. About time you got here. Just what happened to you anyway, Deke Boo? I had to fly over a field of murder hornets on my way over here. They were all trying to gang up on me. I spent the last 20 minutes trying to zap them to get them away from me. Murder hornets? In my anus? Oh, finger doodles. I guess we'd better call Coyote Peterson to come after them. It could be worse. It could be executioner wasps. Ha ha ha. The old clock on the wall tells me I'd better go make an announcement over the intercom. It's time to get this tournament started. I had no idea. Andrew, was the announcer here? Yes, he is. He's wanting to train to be a pro wrestling commentator. So I thought calling Owen tournaments would be good practice for him. They pay him to do that, you know. Attention, ladies and gentlemen. We are about to begin this special quarter of a million dollar tournament here at Spare Me My Anus. But first, we have some special people here to present a word from our sponsor. That is the 1993 PBST Pals logo. That logo has frightened me ever since I was very little. And it still scares me now that I'm a young adult. Holy screen gems, Janet. I had no idea that you were scared of a logo too. What is all the commotion around here? Did my mom get another blobfish in her hair again? <laughs> no, Andrew. It's that creepy 1993 PBSP Cows logo. Just the weirdness of that logo with its three heads put together. And that loud and unnerving singing. Why, that makes the logo just as bad as the class teacher Po robot. <laughs> Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it! You're making me very nervous! Ha 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 
Hickory. Get some mad, 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 logo. I'm getting out of here. My gosh. That PBSP Pals logo is much scarier than me. You ain't kidding, Deaky Bo. Like son, like mother, I guess. Well, I guess I'd better go get my mom before she ends up on the Weather Channel. <laughs> Good grief, Mum. Are you okay? You almost ran out onto the road. I couldn't help it, son. I'm scared to death of that 1993 PBSP Cows logo. I hate it so much. Hate, hate, hate it. Well, you don't have to worry about it now. The PBSP Pals logo is gone. It left after you ran it off. Thank God. Now I can finally focus on winning that $250,000 on that two-week trip to Gatlinburg. Now, go change your underwear. <laughs>